Hey everybody, what's going on? Thanks for tuning in to another video of One Tool a Week. If you're new to the channel, we take a look at tools every week. So if you love tools, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. What is it that we're going to be taking a look at this week? Well, I went ahead and looked at my toolbox and I figured out that I needed to organize a lot better. So I went ahead and picked up these two babies right here. Now let's go ahead and zoom in and see what we got. These are going to be the toolbox wedges right here. And of course, I picked up the plier set and also the screwdriver set and I picked them up for two reasons the pricing was about the same i believe this the screwdriver set was going to set you back for twenty dollars and 98 cents and the plier set was going to set you back for twenty dollars and 99 cents i figured what was the difference and i wanted to look at them personally myself and see what the difference was going to be so i already opened up the one for the plier set which is empty already and the widget set or i'm sorry the screwdriver set let's go ahead and open it up and as you can see, they're going to come together like that. Now, a big difference that was noticeable was that it came with these spacers right here, but we'll get into it right now. So the main purpose is right here are going to be the two different sizes that you're going to get. This one on the left side is going to be for the pliers and the right side is going to be for the screwdrivers. Now, they're both going to have magnets at the bottom that are meant for your toolbox. That way they stick to the metal at the bottom or if you have a tool chest or something like that on top, they're going to stick and catch on they're both gonna have guides on the right on the sides that way you could interlock them and yes both of them do mix and you could interlock both of them that way in case you want to have two different sets and number three was going to be they're going to be the same size as far as the height and the and the links and width on them but the main difference was going to be the notches so if you could tell you can see the pattern right here is more of a u and over here you're going to have more of a v shape now the purpose for the the right one which is the one for your screwdriver is going to be that way your screwdriver doesn't move around or wiggle as much and of course the u shape is going to allow you to fit larger pliers that way you're able to store them and secure them so quick example right here is going to be uh, we have a 10 and one we're able to set it on the plier set but also over here you're able to set it but it's not going to move as much because it's going to be wedged in now i did notice the major difference was going to be with a regular uh, phillips head which i have a climb phillips head right here you go ahead and you put it right there and you can see how it wiggles to the sides but if you put it on the actual screwdriver it's going to set in place and the actual piece is going to move with it now the reason for these widgets is or the wedges or the spacers is going to be because the you're going to see that the handle is going to be a lot wider than a plier. So it's going to take up space. So you're going to go ahead and put the spacer right here. And in case you want to put, let me set this a lot better. Now, in case you want to put some another uh, plot, another set on this side, you're going to be able to put another set and so on, so on. So, of course, guys, you're also going to be able to put, I have some channel lock brand right here tongue and glue priors you're going to be able to set them up just like that or you could set them up further up closer which is going to allow you to store your tools now it was a very neat little item let me see here let me go ahead and put these together right over here and this is going to be the screwdriver set you could put screwdrivers you could still put your lineman pliers right there they're all going to fit very nice and you're going to be able to organize all of them. Now, yes, it is going to organize most of your pliers, screwdrivers, uh, lineman pliers, whatever the case is. But if you're looking to have a 16 inch wrench right here, it will still organize it as well. If you could see, let me see if we could zoom out a tad bit. You're going to be able to see that the 16 inch pliers wrench right there is going to fit which is the nipix 16 inch or the extra large but it will not fit the triple the double xl which is a 22 inch plier wrench on there so oh it will fit it as a matter of fact and there you go you're going to be able to see that it will fit it and it will organize it without moving. Now, if your tool chest is going to close, that's a different story or your toolbox. So keep that in mind, guys. So that's going to be this week's video. I went ahead and picked these up. That way I could organize all my pliers and have everything in order and go from there, guys. Also, guys, thank you all for the support and thanks for watching. One tool a week, guys.